Hi, I am Harish Gaudetti and welcome back to my channel. Today, I am going to talk about the, the most important thing for any AWS partner business which is really how to generate leads, right? So this is really, uh, as the title says, is an ultimate sales funnel masterclass for AWS partners. So in order for you to go ahead and build your partner business, you need a leads day in and day out. And I'm going to show you how to build a sales funnel for your partner business. And uh, so let's dive in. So here's the agenda for today. It's going to be a, a, a little lengthy video because there's going to be a lot of content that I'm going to share with you um, because this is an how to video a tutorial. So it's going to take a while. So first we'll understand what is a sales funnel. Then you can, I, I'll show you AWS partners sales funnel framework that I, you know, after researching, after studying multiple, uh, you know, books and stuff, um, I created this funnel framework, uh, which I'm actually working with uh, one of the one of my customers uh, to uh, clients to go ahead and implement it at this time. So we'll also understand what is an offer. Um, and I'll show you the type of lead generation offers that actually work for AWS partner business. Then you will see some funnel offers that you can offer to your potential leads. And finally, I'll uh, a conclusion to this entire master class. So don't miss out, watch till the end and do subscribe to this channel because I mean, if you didn't watch other videos, it's fine, but this video will help you get a, go a long way with your AWS partner a business. So now let's understand what is a sales funnel. The sales funnel is just a marketing term, um, right? Used to capture and describe the journey that potential customers go through from prospecting to purchase. So a, a, a typical sales funnel has multiple steps, but the actual number of steps depends on the company's sales model. So some companies have multiple steps, some companies have less steps, you know, it all depends on the company's sales model. But it is nothing but the journey that your potential customer goes through uh, till they become a paying customer for your business. So that's what a <coughs> sales funnel is. So now let's understand the AWS partner sales funnel framework. This is extremely important uh, because this is what determines how, how quickly you can build your leads uh, for your partner business. So what you understand is at the top, uh, you know, that those are the ones that actually drive the funnel, right? So the first one is target customer and industry. As an AWS partner, whom do you want to be, you know, be your client, right? So our customer, whom do you want to sell your services or products or solution offerings, right? So what is, who is that customer and what is, is there any specific industry? Hey, you can say, hey, I'm going to talk at target small businesses. Okay, there are like hundreds and thousands of small businesses. Is there a specific industry? Yes, I'm going to target small businesses or small accounting firms or small law firms or small manufacturing companies, you know, whatever it is. So is there an industry that you want to target and a target customer? So that is extremely important without having a clear idea of whom you want to sell or market your services and products nothing is going to happen, right? So target customer and industry is extremely important with respect to um, not just AWS, any, any, any product that you want to offer, right? So the second thing is a service offering. So uh, like I said, this sales funnel framework is specific to AWS partner partners and you won't, you won't find these terms or you won't find these things on a typical marketing sales funnel, you know, course or, you know, whatever you, videos that you find outside for partner programs, service offerings are critical. So what is this offering that you are bringing to the market, right? So what is that you want to offer to the market? So those are service offerings. So you have to define your service offerings clearly, get them, you know, get them FTR approved and have them listed on partner solutions finder. So that's what I mean by service offerings. You can just go ahead and, and create something on your website. That's not what I meant. The definition of service offering is 
you have a very clear understanding of what you want to offer how you want to offer and what does it take to offer that service offering to a potential customer and you document all of that get it approved by aws it's called F uh, service offering ftr process and then it gets listed on partner solutions finder so that is the service offering that i'm talking about so what are the service offerings that you want to offer right the next one is traffic sources from where are you going to get potential leads so is it web i mean are you going to create you know uh, go ahead and update your website with blog or something uh, is that youtube is it facebook is it linkedin is, i mean are you planning to do some events or are you going to join some meetups so it doesn't matter these are all sources of traffic and how to do each traffic source how to implement each traffic source is, is a you know is a process in itself right so how do you generate you know uh, create videos on youtube how do you monetize it so how do you drive traffic to it so it's it's entirely a different uh, you know different discussion to have so basically understand that the traffic sources where where you are going to get your customers or target customers is really important for example if if you are targeting uh, let's just say if you are targeting um, a, a mid-sized business and uh, it leaders of that sort uh, you know for an for an automotive industry it is highly unlikely that you will find them on facebook right so it doesn't matter if you run your ads on facebook they probably won't go into facebook often and also they may go into facebook for you know just upload some of their family stuff but they don't pay attention to anything that has to do with technology or work on facebook right so for them to you know to reach those people the you know probably the play, better place is linkedin right so similarly if you are offering your service offering is for a small business small accounting firm or or a law firm there are like hundreds of facebook groups that you know that are that are talking about accounting cpas and stuff maybe that's when you run your ads or your share your offers on facebook right and and get better results so you need to understand your traffic sources where where will your target customer be so that you can go ahead and reach out to them right so so that's important those are the those are the building blocks those are the main things that start with this you know that will trigger a, a successful sales funnel so the next thing is the top of the funnel right so top of the funnel the goal for the top of the funnel is nesting but awareness hey there is a there is a company there is a brand that exists there is a partner that exists on this planet and that's what they do right so how do you know me like you know, based on my youtube videos and stuff that's how and my linkedin you know updates uh, that's how you know that a guy called harish goteti exists on this planet and he does of help aws partners scale their business right so the goal of you know goal of top of the funnel thing is really awareness and how do you create awareness it's through content so that's the only way to create awareness you can't just go ahead and and so for example right now i have like 400 some sub subscribers right so who who know me and who subscribe to this channel so i can't just go ahead and meet every person there all over the world right so the only way to do is one to many and that happens only through content so top of the funnel in order for your presence to be known for to others you have to start generating a lot of content right so um, that's the top of the funnel goal is only awareness like the next one is middle of the funnel that middle of the funnel goal is interest so what what i mean by interest is they say hey you know this guy is good this company is good this partner is good let's see what they have to offer so now there is an interest so that's how it works so how do i get my clients they watch my videos and they see hey this makes sense this guy knows his stuff let's reach out to him and see if they can help see what he has to offer right so the middle of the funnel is interest and that's where you go ahead and do a lead generation offer so that they you have to capture their interest and and keep them keep that interest going right so that's where you gen, you use these lead generation offers the next step is really the bottom of the funnel is really the goal is sales and and get a paying customer right so 
you can use discounts credits funding options etc which we'll talk in the, in the coming slides so finally once you have the you know the customer the goal is always to retain the customer retention and the upsell so find out what else can you provide in terms of services within aws for that customer so you can actually upsell right so upsell other you know offers and the other services to the customer um so this is the framework on how you have to start building your um, you know sales funnel so if you don't you know start with your target customers then create your service offerings identify your traffic sources um, and, you know set some targets and, and things like that and do uh, do these activities right so that's the partner sales framework so the next step is to understand what is an offer it's simple offer is the goods and services you agree to provide how you accept the payment and terms of the agreement right so hey for this offer all i need is your email address so that's what you are accepting as payment for for this part for for probably giving an ebook or something like that uh, right so for example if you want to say hey i will do a well architected review so that's an offer so what is the in exchange for to that you'll say hey we'll do it for free but we you know we have to be engaged for resolving the identified issues right so that is those are the terms right so of the agreement so things like that so you know offers are generally the first thing any new customer will interact with it in your business so what you're offering is what they'll interact with right so that is really important so how do i you know how do we understand about more about how can you learn more about lead generation and offers right so these are the two amazing books um, by alex hormozy one is called 100 million offers 100 million leads go ahead and and read these books you'll understand you know better on how to promote your services to your potential lead aws customers right so the next one is that i want to talk about is lead generation offers for aws that work so these these typically work for AWS partners, so that's why I'm sharing. First thing is reveal their problem. And how do you do that? You can offer assessment, you can offer reviews, you can offer automated tests, you can provide them with checklists. First thing is like, yeah, typically, hey, say, hey, is your AWS environment uh, secure enough? You know, go ahead and try this assessment or follow, use this checklist to find it yourself or you know stuff like that right so those through assessments reviews and automated tests and checklists you are going to reveal the problem right so that is uh, and why customers want to uh, you know know their problem because they want to they don't they want to avoid heavy you know penalties or heavy damage later and they'll go ahead and go for go for this offer because they can identify if there are any problems ahead of time right so before it's too late so reveal their problem really works the second one is free trails so adoption aws adoption credits start start your journey with aws with for 300 dollars free credits right so or if you have a solution on your solution library they can download it you know using uh download a cloud formation template and, and deploy it right uh or if you have offers on AWS Marketplace, if your services are listed on Marketplace, they can go ahead and give their give that a try on, on the from the Marketplace, right? So those are the free trial, um, you know, offers um, that really work. The next one is one step of a multi-step process. So generally, uh, or everything with related to AWS are requires a lot of work and have multiple steps. So the thing is, like you can say. Uh, you can offer a single st uh, first, first step of a multi-step process for example you can say hey we'll set up the foundational services and management tools uh, with basic automation etc uh, for you right so that's like hey that's the first step so after i set up what should i do after i set up i got this information of what should i do so instead of like so once you the initial setup that you do uh, will actually result in um, you know discovering result in other things that we will follow right so do the first step for free and and then that you know that other things can you know follow through right so those are the lead generation offers for aws that really work and and 
if you look at in like successful marketing AWS partners who are marketing successfully across the board on LinkedIn and other places, you will see the offers are either within these three buckets, right? So these three categories and there is nothing more. So these are the off types of offers that really work. So now funnel offers. So what, what are the things that you can do for the top of the funnel content creation to showcase authority, right? And, and create awareness, ebooks, blogs, videos, white papers, case studies, etc. So middle of the funnel uh, offers, you can create assessments, reviews, checklists, cloud formation templates, implementation guides, uh, etc. So those are the like the middle of the funnel where they'll go ahead and download. They'll they'll show more interest in, in, in you in the, in the partner than you know what the top of the funnel uh, you know people people do right. So those are that's the really the important one. Funnel the bottom of the funnel offers are really once a customer is interested, you do like POC, POC funding, funding options, map programs, immersion days co-selling with AWS, all of those things are really the final step in eliminating any more blockers that you probably have in doing the sale is what uh, in, in converting the, customer, the the lead into a paying customer is what the, the, the bottom of the funnel is about. So these are the offers that you can give uh, offer to your potential uh, AWS uh, clients um, to, to build your partner business successfully. And I mean, to conclude, the final thing is qualified leads are the foundation for building a successful AWS partner business, right? But it takes time, it takes expertise and a lot of testing to implement a successful sales funnel, um, right? You know, that can really tax your business. So what, what I really suggest is if you are serious about it, if you need help building a customized sales funnel for your AWS partner program, I reach out to me and then yeah we can discuss um, uh, the options i hope this video is useful i mean this is extremely important and this framework tells you what to do next and what how it works so that you can plan accordingly and uh, thanks for watching and do subscribe to this channel